Should I trust these enough to buy eight of them? So I needed a solution to light this shop up and uh, I decided to go with eight of the 10,000 lumen Harbor Freight Brawn lights. And I have got them already installed and I'll show you a few uh, clips of that in a second. So in each one of these packs, <clears throat> you get the actual fixture itself, wrapped in some nice bubble wrap, some chains, mounting hardware, and um, these little tube looking, let's see, I'm covering the LEDs, you've got these little round tubes. And it does have a pull push-pull switch, which we're not going to do because we're going to plug them in. <clears throat> we're going to link them. This says that we these are linkable and we can link up to four lights. So we're going to link two sets of four. Okay, and you, of course you get your owner's manual. Never change a bulb. <clears throat> well, I hope I don't have to change the whole light. Consumes 18% less energy than typical four bulb units. Diamond texture, texture for wide light dispersion. And as you can see, these are 47.37 inches in length. And here's everything in the bag laid out. You've got some of these drywall hangers. We're not going to use those. Four little screws, two little hangers, and uh, these hanging things and two chains. So, I mean, it's not very beefy, but probably do for what I'm going to use it for. The different ways to mount this, one is this little screw, it comes with four of these. You can put four of those in, you have two on each side, okay? Or you can take this little hanger here and you put it through some holes there and then you can hang it with the chain. Goes right there. <clears throat> and this is where you link them. So supposedly this is 10,000 lumen. Uh, Hopefully with eight of those things up here. So we're going to link four and four. And I'm going to make it easy. We're going to put a, um, at the end, probably that end, just a plug in. And we'll link four of those there and four of those there. That's the plan anyway. And in case you're wondering how far you can link these apart, this uh, cable on each one of them, the power cord, is right at five feet, 60 inches. So you can have a light, five feet, a light, five feet, and go, you know, four of those, which ought to do pretty good for up there. And the way I'm gonna get up there is this here, I ran from the old Home Depot. Well, one thing, this thing did not, this lift did not come charged. See how it's flashing there? The lady that uh, rented it to me, she said, hey, look, uh, this is, I rented it for 24 hours, and it's, but it's not charged up. I'm like, okay, how long does it take to charge? I don't know, eight hours. I said, really? So you ought to subtract eight hours because I can't use it for eight hours worth of time. And she just kind of looked at me. So on that, let's hope this thing works. So yes, I'm extremely satisfied with these. So uh, as you heard, the instructions say you can link four of them. So that's what I did. What I did was I uh, put a, um, you can see just a simple plug right there instead of wiring them all up. And then uh, in the future, that way I can just plug and link. The same thing with this one here. And as you can see, they are linked together. Daisy chain together. And according to the directions, you can do four, which is what I did. I have four on that circuit and four on this circuit. And um, so my overall thoughts is that uh, they work extremely well. Um, the light is not glaring. The diffusers on it work really well. So when I'm looking up at the ceiling, I'm not blinded by any crazy lights. Now, in comparison, these 
uh, little shop lights. I got these on clearance at Walmart. These are hyper tough, and uh, I literally got them for like $7. And when you kind of look at these, uh, these are just, uh, I think, 3,000 lumen, but it gives a crazy glare. You can see each LED, uh, so it's not too bad when I'm working on the surface, but when you look up at the light, uh, it's not a very uh, pleasant experience. Unlike the Harbor Freight Brawn, that diffuser uh, makes it really nice. In case you're interested, the Hyper Tough ones, these here are the uh, LED SL-5 version. And of course, the Braun version, the version I have is 56780. Now outdoors, I decided to go a different route. These Braun uh, lights are not waterproof. So I went to Lowe's and got some of these vapor lock. Uh, bulbs and as you can see these have the uh, you know the outdoor wiring and these are actually sealed uh, a sealed fixture they're not as bright as the Braun Harbor Freight but they're waterproof which is what I needed and in case you're interested that is these models here these Metalux LED vapor tight excuse me so um, but the video is about the Braun and uh, so far, so good. They were extremely easy to hook up. Obviously, I just left the chains hanging, but they are on a switch. So I'm extremely satisfied with these lights so far. Only time will tell if they're gonna hold up, but uh, we'll see if they falter, I'll let you know. So have a great Christmas. And we'll